Hey, this is Nick Nielsen, the Mad Scientist of Muscle, and what I've got for you today here is a review of a unique piece of training equipment that is actually not necessarily really training equipment. It's physical resistance clothing. Now, the cool concept of this is essentially you're including band resistance into compression of either shorts or leggings so that when you're doing specific movements, you're actually getting resistance during those movements based on what you're wearing not based on external loading like dumbbells or ankle weights or anything like that. Now, the beauty of this is you can wear it for any athletic endeavor. It's very effective for that. Um, I'm gonna show you a, a pair of the shorts that I've got right here. And I'm not wearing them right now because I want to actually show you what's going on on the inside of these shorts. That's where the action really happens on it. So they're basically, uh, you know, bike length shorts. These are large. They're compression shorts that have a band, actually two pairs of bands, right inside of the shorts. So this is what they look like on the outside. I'm actually going to flip them inside out here so you can see the bands on the inside. Now, this is one of the bands that goes across and the other one is sewn into the fabric underneath. So as you're doing um, athletic training, specifically like walking, running, movement is going to be the best bet for this. This specific movement, hip extension, like with the glutes and the hamstrings, that's what's going to be resisted. And it gives you about 15 to 20% greater resistance. Um, what the creators of this liken this to is basically like walking or running through water. So you're not getting a heck of a lot of resistance, but you're getting enough to make a difference in terms of um, boosting calorie burning, boosting power, um, it's actually um, something I've tested out using these. I've done hill sprints, I've done loaded carries up and down the street, and you do need movement to make these worthwhile. Um, I wouldn't actually necessarily recommend using these during your regular weight training. You can if you want. Um, for example, if you're doing squats, I like the compression factor of it, and you will get a little bit more added resistance as you're coming out of the bottom due to the extra um, resistance you'll find built right into here. So. Um, overall, very, very well constructed, very well designed. These are uh, extremely tight, so when you're wearing them, you want to make sure that they're not um, too loose. You want to get a size that's really, really tight fitting because that's what's going to anchor right onto your body. So for example, when I wear these, I really have to hike them up, um, switch them on, and, and make sure that you know, you're doing these so that you're anchored in, essentially. Now, when you're wearing them, <coughs> The band's basically set so that this band anchors, comes across and anchors down into here. So as you're doing this movement, this band across here is stretching and vice versa with the other band across here. So as you can see, not particularly comfortable in a lot of ways. It's not like something you're gonna wear just every day, just for fun, because <laughs> like I said, comfort factor is not really the primary reason to wear these. This is all about burning more calories and getting more resistance in a hip extension type of movement. So any, anything to do with athletic training, you're going to love these. It's going to help boost your power and um, really allow you to get more out of your training when you're doing athletic training. So, all right, now the bottom line with the physical leggings and or shorts, they're very well designed, very solidly constructed. They're basically built to last and these are really serious pieces of training equipment. This is not just fluff like a Spanx that has a few little flimsy little bands in them. These are designed for athletic training. They're going to be very effective for cardio training like walking, uh, running, sprinting, uh, up and down hill sprints. Very good for that. Um, you can use them for weight training. It's not going to make that big of a difference during your weight training, uh, especially if you're doing just stuff that's done with standing or lying down. Can contribute a little bit more when you're doing squats but I prefer them definitely for the cardio style training for explosiveness in athletic uh, performance. So if you're interested in these, I, I definitely recommend them. Highly, highly effective stuff. And um, you can learn more about them at the link down below here. Get a pair and try them for yourself. Again, get them a little bit on the tight side. That's going to really grip in and give you a little bit more added compression and a little bit more added resistance as you're doing them. If they're too loose, 
you're not going to get nearly as much uh, benefit from them. So give them a try, and if you try them, let me know how you like them.